will be equal to n plus x the already we know either you are increase you are adding x percent of n or you are uh, subtracting x percent of n or d ratio will be same now 15 by 20 we have taken one ratio now 20 percent increase that is equal to x percent that will be 18 here also 20 percent increase that is y percent means we can say if x percent is equal to y percent now we are just focused on two ratio two different this is one ratio we are just making another ratio now we can think in different way two ratio is there and we have to compare which one is more which one is less you are getting my idea earlier in properties we have seen one ratio if you are making some change you are doing some arithmetic operations then resultant ratio will be more or less compared to original ratio or base ratio here we will just relook the same thing in different way two ratio you have then between these two ratio which one will be more which one will be less how to compare just will reverse that same property will check the percentage change of numerator and denominator if percentage change in numerator and denominator both are same then we can we will say ratio will be always same if it is not same ratio will not same then we have to decide which one is more which one is less based on that ratio will be either greater or less then here first we have seen two ratio we have 15 by 20 and 18 by 24 we have to decide 15 by 20 is equal to 18 by 24 or it is not equal to 18 by 24 then 15 by 20 just will look if this 15 to 18 we are going this is 20 percent change that is numerator change that is x percent denominator 20 to 24 that is also y percent that is also 20 percent means x percent is equal to y percent then we will say 15 by 20 is equal to 18 by 24.